Have you ever wondered about the implications of Iran's burgeoning satellite program? Let's take a step back to where it all began. Iran's satellite program sprouted from a seed of ambition, nurtured by the Ministry of Defense and Armed Forces Logistics. The first significant milestone was the launch of the Soraya satellite. This event marked Iran's entry into the exclusive club of spacefaring nations. However, this achievement was not without controversy. The vehicle used to carry Soraya into space was a rocket, a technology that could potentially be used for long-range ballistic missiles. This sparked concerns in the West, as it was feared that this technological leap could bolster Iran's ballistic missile program. Nevertheless, Iran pressed on, striving to make its mark in the cosmos. While the program's inception was marked by controversy, it was just the beginning of a series of intriguing developments. Iran's recent satellite launches have not only marked significant progress but also raised eyebrows worldwide. The triumphant launch of three satellites, one weighing 32 kilograms and two less than 10 kilograms each, was made possible by the Simorg carrier rocket, a testament to Iran's advancing aerospace capabilities. These aren't just any satellites. The two nano-satellites named Kehan-2 and Hatef-1 serve a critical purpose. They are set to test narrowband communication and geopositioning technology, pushing the frontiers of Iran's technological prowess and paving the way for future advancements. But, the story doesn't end here. Enter the Qayyam, a three-stage solid propellant space launch vehicle, another feather in Iran's cap. This launch vehicle isn't just a technological marvel, it signifies a significant leap in Iran's long-range strike capabilities. The Qayyam's successful launch sends a clear message. Iran is making strides in the realm of intercontinental ballistic missile technology. These achievements, impressive as they are, also come with a dose of unease. The dual nature of these technologies, their potential use for both peaceful exploration and military endeavors, has sparked a global dialogue. Are these advancements purely for research and exploration, or do they signal a more ominous shift in Iran's strategic capabilities? These developments have not only bolstered Iran's missile capacity but also sparked concerns about their potential for dual use. The NOR satellite system with its potential spying capabilities has significantly boosted Iran's abilities in space. Rising from the Sharud Desert, these satellites have been launched into low Earth orbit aboard the three-stage Kassed space launch vehicles, marking a new era in Iran's space endeavors. The NOR satellites are not just orbiting hunks of metal, they are equipped to provide the Iranian Revolutionary Guard with high-resolution overhead imagery. This capability adds a new dimension to Iran's intelligence and command operations, offering a bird's-eye view of the world below. Among these satellites, the NOR-3 stands out with its advanced features. It can capture images in different light spectrums with high quality and resolution, making it a versatile tool for various applications. But that's not all. It also provides telecommunication relay services, sending commands and receiving data over long distances in real time. This capability could be crucial for controlling drones and sea vessels from afar. Moreover, the NOR-3 offers global positioning services for missile guidance and navigation systems. This means that it could play a critical role in the development of Iran's missile program, enhancing its targeting and navigation capabilities. With the launch of the NOR satellites, Iran's timeline to develop an ICBM has shortened, causing concern in the global community. This development signals a significant technological leap for Iran, but also raises serious questions about the potential military implications of its satellite program. The rapid advancements in Iran's satellite program have far-reaching implications, both domestically and internationally. With each launch, Iran inches closer to being a global space player. But these advancements are not without controversy. The satellite launches, some believe, could potentially serve as a smokescreen for Iran's intercontinental ballistic missile program. The technology used in these launches is almost identical to that used in ICBMs, fueling these concerns. Moreover, Iran's investment in hypersonic weapons adds another layer to this complex puzzle. These weapons, capable of reaching space and re-entering Earth's atmosphere at hypersonic speeds to strike a target, are a testament to Iran's technological prowess. But this progress has raised alarms internationally. Iran's proximity to nuclear capability, coupled with its advancements in space technology, has the world on edge. As Iran continues to make strides in its satellite program, the world watches with bated breath, wondering what the next chapter will bring. 